Cambridge Police Department and East Tennessee Children's Hospital now teaming up to host car seat checkpoints. This is so important because a recent report shows only 10% of all parents actually install these correctly. That's really low. That is why certified technicians will be on hand to examine car seats and to check for manufacturer recalls. Well, new tonight, WATE 6 on your side reporter Bridget Bjorlo shows us how the community is making sure your family stays safe out on the roads. We do it as often as possible. Mother of two, Stacy Cox, wants to make sure her family stays safe on the roadway. I think the safety of my children is the most important thing, and anything that I can do to, you know, keep that going for them, I'll do it. Every year, she tries to stop by this car seat checkpoint put on by the Oak Ridge Police Department and the East Tennessee Children's Hospital, where certified technicians go from vehicle to vehicle examining car seats to make sure these safety tools are properly installed. It's good to have an extra set of eyes checking things out. Not only an extra set of eyes, but an extra set of eyes who know what they're doing. And more often than not, mistakes are discovered. We have found in a lot of these events is that most car seats that come in are installed improperly. Properly. Oak Ridge Police Lieutenant John Kelly says families make common mistakes when setting up their car seat. A lot of mistakes are they just the uh, seat is not properly secured in the car. It's too loose, kind of tends to flop around a little bit, or the harness straps are too loose, or on a chillier morning like this morning, they'll put the child in the seat with a big coat on and then put the harness straps on. Train technicians additionally look out for things that are harder to spot, like manufacturer recalls. This program is also helpful in letting parents know if their current car seat is expired. Like this car seat that was replaced from a car just a few minutes ago. The event serves as not just a safety check, but also a teaching tool for parents. Learning to make sure that he is safely strapped in, you know, buckled accordingly. I'm like, do I have it this way? Do I, you know, but always take learning advice. So there's always something to be done right. Because when it comes to children and cars, Cox says it's always wise to put safety first. It could be life saving. In Oak Ridge, Bridget Bjorlo, WATE 6, on your side. All right, thank you, Bridget. Great program. We should mm -hmm. point out Oak Ridge Police hosting another checkpoint tomorrow. It's being held in the parking lot across the street from the Oak Ridge Preschool that's right off of New York Avenue. Now, the safety check uh, kicks off at 8 in the morning and goes through 1 p.m. Parents are encouraged to secure their car seat before arriving to see if they did indeed install it properly. It is so tricky to do. Even if you think you've got it right, right. it's worth going by there and I getting it checked out. I remember those days. Yeah. They could be difficult. Yeah, so it's good to get it, you know, have some look it over real quick, mm -hmm. make sure you are doing it correct. All right.